Income source of extra income by next July unless they sell a player or make a profit from a good cup run. But at least they're still in the cup after beating non-league Sutton 2-1 last night. Well, those who did turn up hoped Swindon would turn it on a bit. But after just 90 minutes, it was Sutton's Mickey Joyce who was in the right place to give the visitors the lead. And that was his 21st goal of the season. Well, Swindon also had problems with the visitors' goalkeeper, Dave Collier. A good move between Rideout and Carter set Andy Rowland up, but the keeper wouldn't be beaten. Mike Graham was the next Swindon player to test him, but his shot was deflected wide. Then, just before half-time, it was Swindon who equalised. Roy Carter turned in a quarter from the left, a corner from the left, and the players breathed a sigh of relief. The Swindon started the second half with a spring in their heel. Graham finds right out with a lovely through ball. A neat back heel there to Gary Williams and the looking good. And Roy Carter was unlikely not to turn that header into a second goal. But Sutton was still looking dangerous. The free kick causes problems. And that leap by Russell Lewis is sufficient to put Joyce off. But Swindon was still making hard work of their chances, and Andy Rowland's effort is just saved there. Then moments later, Dave Collier kept Swindon out again, and it was Rowland the unlucky player once more. Just seconds before time, Howard Pritchard gave Swindon a trip to Luton in round three with a real opportunist goal. But with only two cup wins in ten games since they went top of Division Three in October, Swindon still have plenty of problems to work out.